I have known ever since I discovered the ability to nut that I have numb genitals. I always wondered why I felt so drawn to chasing something which gives me very little sensation. Now, sex ed was pretty pathetic for us back then. It was more of a STD scare tactic propaganda center. They never told us that our genitals were routinely cut in the United States of America. And if they did mention it, it was glossed over. So during my younger years with these numb genitals, I just came to the belief that intercourse for a man is the satisfaction of a biological urge, whereas for a woman, it is a physically pleasurable experience. And I just accepted that. The first time I ever heard the word circumcision was on Seinfeld. And I had just assumed that because I was being raised Christian and not Jewish, that this was a mutilation that I had dodged. I thought that circumcision sounded horrible, but it sounded like something that I had avoided and something that I had no place having an opinion on. I actually took my mutilated genitals and wondered to myself what part they cut off. Now in my early 20s, I finally learned what circumcision is and that it affects me. And my whole grip on reality shattered. And suddenly I have everybody in my life telling me what to think and how to feel about my own body and my own experience. And listen, be sure to join them in the comments. And keep in mind, I am a man and I talk about men's problems on the internet. So you have so much to work with there. You could say I'm a insecure, toxic, misogynist incel, or any other variation of those shaming tactics used against men that talk about any of the systemic problems that we are facing right now.